Welcome back. It is Saturday, and you know what that means? It's yard sale day. There's a woozy doll. <laughs> Cute little thing. 50 cents. I think. Five dollars Oh, cool fireplace. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hi. Hi. How are you all doing today? Oh, can't complain about a thing. Oh, Pretty awesome fireplace. I know, isn't it crazy? Mm -hmm. Just have to leave that behind. Oh, yeah. It's a nice house. Yeah, he's a lot of work, but yeah, it looks like the porch is kind of or the garage kind of sinking a little. Well, I guess this whole neighborhood was like a swamp at one time. Oh, okay. Right? Everything's very cheap. Okay. So. Well, we like that. Yeah. Now oh, that is a cool oh, free, fireplace. Really. I just uh, I don't want to. I don't want to carry it. Oh, that's a cool old TV. Yeah, it works. Does it? I just plugged it in a few minutes ago. Oh, really? I don't know what, how you would hook your cable up to it or whatever, but... Yeah, I don't know. Five bucks. Five bucks. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. How much for the... Oh, it's broken, but... How much for this? Um, three dollars. Okay. Yeah, it's broken. Two dollars? Yeah, I'll take that. Light bright. Almost free. Sale too. No way. Yeah, that's okay. real oh, okay, yeah. We can get all that still. Okay. Okay. Yeah, you can buy the rubber for still to this day. Mm. I trust you. The rubber and the yeah. It's full of oh hankies.
she's so cute. Oh yeah, I'm sorry, those aren't for sale. Yeah. Oh, they're not? Yeah, those are for Oh. <laughs> that was my grandma. Oh, she's so cute. Yeah, she's doll, right? Aww. Yeah. That's okay. This was in there, it's just, this is not for sale? The hankies? Um, what is that? My mom wrote notes over everything. That was the tallest building in the world. Oh, yeah. Those are cool. Those are pretty fun. Uh, okay. Okay. I have that clock for five bucks. It's real stone. Good luck, I think I'll take that. You know, I really enjoyed that clock. I just had it on my bed. Such a uh, thing. Did you ever try it? Like, did you ever have the wine? Um, no. I just was interested in it. Oh, it looks nice. Are you guys interested in any light fixtures? I've got a tri lamp in the. I'll take a look. It's quite expensive, though. So. Graphics, kind of fun. Vintage glasses. Oh, those are old. Hmm, let's see if I can't get this guy to work. In. How much? Not like I'm a clocksmith, but I can give it a try. Ship. It's that stone, right? Okay. Whatever it is, right like there. the black. That's too bad. Yeah, they've got the black on the bottom of it. Oh, and on the sides. Yeah, no, it's all built on a stone. Yeah. So it's like, I love that thing. It's just. It's I like the design. Yeah. It's really nice. You actually have it on the face on the front oh. or the back there. Oh yeah. I almost want to buy this TV. Awesome. Yeah. I don't know what I'd do with it. That's yeah, just, that's kind of fun. Yeah. Kind of cool. Definitely worth getting going. Yeah. Is that clock guy still on 33rd? I don't know. I'll have to get, like, the, that's threaded there. So if I can oh, yeah. find something to thread onto there, I can probably oh, get yeah. it to wind. Okay. That's a good old ruler. I'm gonna unload these guys up. Okay, okay, you're gonna buy that? Yep. for the clothes? Anywhere from three to ten. Well, small, it's pretty 
pretty cool. It's a pretty small size though. This was fun. This dress. That is bright. That's fun. Too big and too small for me, though. How much for the purse? Fifteen. And this one? Oh, I can. Did you get to many garage sales today? Yeah, we've been to quite a few. Mm. Would you take 10 for this no, one? No, I don't think no? so. No. I do antique shows and I can, you know, get a lot more for them there, but yeah. I'm just getting so much, too many of the too, too many much, things. too much stuff. It's a lovely purse. Mm -hmm. This little pajama bag. Remember oh yeah, that? yeah. I say she's not old enough to remember that's why, what those are. That's why. That's why I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to educate her. Yes. Oops. You just put your pajamas in the bottom because as it goes in the. Uh huh. You put your pajamas in the zipper up and then the belt just sat on the bed. Yeah, then you then you stick it on the bed as a decoration. Oh. How much do you want for her? How much do you want for her? Um, three dollars, I guess would be good. Okay. You have three dollars? Do you want a bag for that? Um, I don't think I need a bag. Keep it clean. Is that what is that pajama bag? Oh, I see. Well, if I know you have thing, I'll put the price up. And I might not get it then. <laughs> I'm just going to set her there.
So this is everything that I got from the yard sales. I picked up this, I believe this is a woozy doll. I haven't really looked to see if she has any markings on her or anything, but I think she's called woozy, a woozy doll. And I think she was 50 cents, 25 or 50 cents, I can't remember. I grabbed these dog salt and pepper shakers, kitschy ceramic dogs with real fur. I think that's real fur tails. They're made in Japan, sitting on a bench. And I grabbed these from a yard sale. I don't think it was in the video. They're just little hors d'oeuvre forks. This one's cool. I think it's broken, but it's a mermaid. <laughs> yeah, so I got this whole box for 50 cents, party novelties. And then I got all these items from one yard sale, the one that was in the porch. I picked up these Empire, New York Empire State Building shot glasses. And I think I just paid a couple dollars for those. I grabbed these because I just thought they were fun. I like the graphics and the, the font on them. They are hair nets. <laughs> And then I grabbed this box and there was a bunch of little pins inside, little, these little pins, which I don't know, I haven't really looked through to see if there's any that have any value, but she said I whatever I could fit in this box, I could have the whole thing, I think for a couple dollars. So I just threw a bunch of jewelry in there. I don't know if there's any value to any of these pieces. None of them look like they could be silver. Maybe this piece. But just mostly pins, but I mostly just wanted this tin. Doesn't have the key, I don't think, although it could be inside the box, I don't know. But I just really like the tin, and I got everything for two dollars, so I got that. And then this really pretty cushion cover was just a few dollars, really beautiful. It's got some staining on the back, so. Not sure if I can get that out. Might try and soak that in some Oxy and get it clean. And then this was a nice score. It was only $2 for this Empoli decanter, but the lid is broken. But that could be cut off and whatever. So it's not sharp. <laughs> I can't think of what it's called, but it was only $2 for that. So I'll probably just try and sell that locally. So that was everything that I got from that sale. Wendell got a really, really old picture of a horse picture. And I think we took that out to our country home. So we don't have anywhere to put it right now. And he also got a really cool clock. But I can show you that at the end of the video. And I went to a sale I don't think this was in the video, but there was some jewelry, so I just picked up these pieces. This has got abalone shell stretch bracelet, and this is made out of pottery. It is marked something Jou. I think that's French. I thought it was a really nice piece made out of pottery. That was a dollar, I think, a dollar or two. This set, I think, was two dollars. Copper, moon, and wolf brooch and earring set and I grabbed this pajama girl her pajama doll you put your pajamas in the bottom of her and she sits on the bed she was three dollars and she still has her original piece of tag stuck to her and some plastic so she looks almost brand new she's got a little whoop, that comes off but she looks like 
almost brand new condition. I don't think she's that old, maybe 1970s maybe. She's not a really old one. I, I did pick up a really old one from a yard sale and it was, it was very old. I would say 1940s. This one's definitely not that old. Maybe 1960s, I don't know for sure. But that will be in a whatnot sale. That already happened. <laughs> and then I went to a I went to an estate sale. And we didn't know it was happening. We were going to some some yard sales in the neighborhood and we stumbled across an estate sale. And when we got there everything was 50% off. So I got this beautiful piece of glass for two dollars. I took the tag off, but it was marked four, but it was fifty percent off, so I got it for two dollars. I'm not sure if this is Murano glass or not. The bottom is polished, but it's a little bit cloudy. I don't know if that's just from age and wear, but it's a really nice piece. That'll probably go in an upcoming whatnot sale. And then this piece was four dollars. It's a nice, nice piece of glass, possibly Murano, maybe chalet glass. I don't know though. I haven't done research on those pieces, so I'm not I'm not 100% sure. And this was $4, really pretty tin. Probably made in England is my guess. And then this was $2. Just a picture of the Lord's Supper. There's no no maker or anything. It just says monarch, a monarch product handmade by veterans so that could be the frame a really nice beautiful frame i'll probably maybe put that in a upcoming whatnot sale or it might go on my etsy this is the clock he got it is i think it is marble it's super heavy it feels like marble this is metal and it's carved on the corners oh my fan my fan just kicked in Something just kicked in. There's some, some background noise. So it does work. And then it's really heavy, solid, old clock. So that is everything for today. Thank you so much for joining me. If you are not already subscribed, please consider subscribing. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Leave a comment down below. And you can check my links in the description of this video. You can follow me on Whatnot. I also have a Eclectic Vintage Thrifter Instagram as well as my Etsy shop Instagram, Fifth Avenue Vintage Co. And you can check out my Etsy shop, Fifth Avenue Vintage Co. All the links are in the description of this video. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Until next time, I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.